I'm sorry, I think we're going to have a problem, Cheeky C, you and I. What on earth do you mean, not that kind of lesson? There's only one kind of lesson, the lesson in which you learn. Wah! I just wanted to do that, to be completely honest with you folks. I had razor eye surgery recently. Me, the Dr. Surgeon MD. I held myself down with a strong arm and with the other, I took a giant laser. It was a mess. <laughs> a true disaster. I don't know what to tell you. It was horrible. But I can see now. Just the odd hallucination of things to come. <laughs> Quick, though, I perform CPR on the doctor. It, it, look, oh! Excellent fragging, Ardvard Luke. Enjoy your e <laughs> What the heck was that? Uh, I understand what you're saying, all right? Look, rest up. This is the most important thing. Doctor prescribes rest and a heck of a lot of tea. Don't forget, folks, keep calm and make tea. That's the best way, the British way. Uh, hello, one and all. I'm just catching up on all of these things here. Uh, cheeks, uh, sleep is for the week, but all- Oh, good, good, good. I was going to say jokes, jokes, jokes. Welcome, one and all. Yes, so, you may have noticed I am, of course, missing two of my trademark pieces. My strange little short front teeth and my glasses. Uh, the f second I have explained already, uh, I did not go for the classic pencil-in-eyeball removal method. Instead, I went for the slightly more advanced technique, because, you know... I believe that I'm worth it. Hashtag he's worth it. Hashtag maybe he's worth it. Maybe it's Maybelline. But the two front teeth is because I also performed dental surgery on myself. That's right. I knocked out all my teeth with a rusty hammer and put them all back in one by one. But frankly, it's amazing that they look this good. <laughs> Welcome one and all to a brand new series of the Dr. Surgeon MD, that's me, the Dr. Surgeon MD's Medical Lecture Series f for Medical Surgical Techniques and Philosophy. Yeah, I think it was that. Um, the Dr. Surgeon MD's Medical Lecture Series for Surgical Techniques and Medical Philosophy. Yeah, there you go. Also known as the MST... No, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> Interns for Life. Good. Well, I am X... Oh, good. Okay, Zen Robo has her hot liquid in a mug. Doesn't matter what kind, as long as you're sipping it to cool it down. I'm very happy. Oh, everyone's here. Good, good. Yeah, well, parking will be validated after the lecture. Yes, you have to stay for the whole thing. All right. Or else you have to pay your own damn parking. Hello, one and all. I'm so happy to see so many bright, shining faces here for a new medical lecture series. Interns for life, as Cheeky C says. All the cool kids are saying it. Get your shit together! And where have I been? That's a good question. One I don't have to answer. But I will. Because I'm cool like that. Alright, okay, that's enough, Doc. Just shut up. Shut up over there. Look, the... <laughs> oh, Bellandora, I'm so happy to hear you say that. Because some people wouldn't uh, agree with you. Some people believe my qualifications are theoretical and don't actually exist and lead to malpractice suits and death. Some people would be wrong. That's all I have to tell you. Rock Pants is here. Paximo's here. Cheeks is here. John Vera, Bellandora, Zen Robo. Oh, JC, Luke has been and gone. And I think we have Shard and Jay as well. Oh, my goodness gracious. Look at all these wonderful people. Uh, John Verrill, I am so... Athelia just dropped by. Hello, Athelia. John Verrill, I'm so happy to hear your burneritis has cleared up. Was it one of my techniques... Uh, the manual stimulation, the, the machine stimulation, uh, the slow pump it and dump it method. I'm so sorry. I did not. I absolutely. That's uh, enough out of me. All right. <clears throat> Just in, the, in case you thought this was going to be a family stream. Hang on. What? Oh, it is a family stream. Oh, boy. Well, that's going to be very, very difficult. <laughs> uh, Zen Robo, at the risk of being a little rude. Ka-ching! All right. <laughs> um, yes, I have heard something of the roller coaster of Bitcoin. Now, I only... The only... Whoa! Ah, actually... Hmm, thank you for the follow. But what do you mean by death, Bellandora? This is the question. I don't believe... Hmm. I'm not sure if that's 
I'll, I'll take a look at that at a later moment. Bill and Dora, death is what we make of it. It's a point at which you are no longer alive, but it's just part of the circle of life. You know what I mean? It's not, it's not something to worry about. It's something to welcome sometimes, uh, or fear uh, other times. Look, uh, this isn't my prepared lecture for today. What I wanted to discuss with you all today, and I think it's a very important thing, is new beginnings. In health, often we have new beginnings. Uh, say you receive a new leg, uh, a new head. Uh, perhaps you have... Uh, you, you, oh, good, good, good. Uh, rock pants, I'm, I'm happy to hear it. Set up a recording device so you can listen to my voice anytime you want. I don't know. So Just, just, just do that, all right? <laughs> um, what was I going to say? Yes, new beginnings. I feel like it's important. You know, John Verrill used to have a severe case of burneritis, probably the most severe I've ever seen in person with my own two eyes and hands. But new beginnings. You know, whoopla, etc. Oh, Chardon, Jay, come on. I mean, look, look, look. I'm, I don't consider myself technically minded, except in the, uh, in, except in the original uh, Latin uh, uh, meaning of the word technical. Technic from the Latin technus, meaning to touch. It, it Look, it <laughs> doesn't make any sense. Uh, oh, boy. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Technically, I'm a doctor. A doctor of what? It doesn't matter. I practice the ancient science and art of medicine. And we have one motto here. On the Dr. Surgeon MD's medical lecture series for surgical technique and medical philosophy. And that motto, say it with me now, children. We must do some harm in order to do no harm. That is the most important rule to remember, even above the tea. Because sometimes you don't have tea, but it's all right. You can have water or, or wine or sake or the, the blood of the patient. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Thank you, Cheeky C. Cheeks remembers. Are you sitting at the front of the class, Cheeks, or are you one of those cool kids at the back? I can't see. It's the laser eye surgery. Hmm. JC here as well. Good, good. Some people remember. What is this dangly bit here? You may be wondering to yourself. Does it have something to do with the tea? No, it's purely ornamental. Brits, such as myself, make tea in order to present our status to the world. If you are drinking tea, it means you are attempting to move on with your day. If you are not drinking tea, you're clinically dead. That's I'm that's my opinion, and I'm sticking to it. New beginnings. I, I, Bell and Donna, I, I have many doctorates. Frankly, it's hard to keep track. <laughs> they call me Dr. Surgeon MD. I have many stories about my time in Africa with my parents, etc. Right, exactly. Sharon Jay is correct. Sharon Jay, with the name reflecting the wine, in fact, don't think I didn't notice. I'm a smart cookie. And cookies are quite smart amongst the baked world. Not like those goddamn shoe pastries. Animals. Doesn't make sense. Uh, we're gonna jump in here. Look, the point is, interns, today there are new beginnings. I have been invited to head a new team. <laughs> John Jay, my goodness. That is, I mean, I suppose I did say it wasn't a family channel. No, I said it wasn't a family stream. No, you, you get your tag straight. I can see a tag poking out of your shirt. New, be g new beginnings, exactly, JC. Did I ever tell you about the time that I did a transplant on a new? Not a, not a, not a new new. It was an old new, obviously. Ah, only fans of my streams. I had only fans once. It's very hot. Need an air conditioner. Some people say I should try comedy. I just say my life is one big joke. I am an invited to head. <laughs> I have been invited to head a team, my friends. Look at this. Access all areas. Oh, we'll make sure we have enough uh, sound. I, I want you to hear every beautiful word. Yes, Bellandora Nom. That is the sound I make when I consume food as well. Congratulations. You are human. I have been invited to head an elite crack squad team of surgeons, doctors, and doctor surgeons in order to perform as many critical surgeries as necessary. Sometimes those surgeries may be architectural rather than medical. We will have to see. 
I have a whole- and interns! Exactly. We, there are many interns. I love all of you all. You're wonderful people. Let's start. Oh, I have to make sure I can hear what's going on, too. So, while we sit here, I'll just mention ex exactly what's going on. Barnisher General was, of course, destroyed in the great goat das goat disaster, Disaster. Disaster goat. goat disaster. Trisha 3.0. What a goddamn goat disaster. <laughs> Daughter. I also thought it wasn't. It was, I also thought it was very funny. It's good the way you wrote it. It's very funny. Keep it up. Yeah. We'll have to see if this. Sometimes it just likes to. They like to keep me waiting. Hashtag waiting room simulator 2021. Papow. I spent money on this. All right. Yeah. Bonacha General did not survive the Great Goat Apocalypse of uh, 20 whatever. 18, 17, I don't know, something like that. Um, and so, unfortunately, we, um, we've we had to rebuild. But they have rebuilt. Bigger, better, faster, stronger than before. Probably larger, thicker, you know, larger hallways, that sort of thing. To accommodate multiple different gurneys racing up and down. The longest hospital in the world! And they have asked me to head a team there. Crack team of surgeons and doctors and doctor surgeons. I've already said this. Bellandora asks an excellent question. Do we need to sign waivers? Strict answer, no. You do not need to do anything. Life is all about free will and choice. I don't believe in fate. Other than my fate to become the greatest doctor surgeon MD of all time. What I do think is important is that you all understand the risks of being here. The surgical room is not a safe place. <gasps> what? R Roger Tw- Oh, no! Oh, Roger! No, no, that's a couple doors down. Couple doors down, Roger Twy. You have to- Yeah, it, no, no, the, the fishing is on the other- Fishing is on the other end. It's, it's closer to the lake. Oh, hello, Thelia! Goodbye, Thelia! If you come back at all, Thelia, we'll probably still be here on this loading screen because- Ugh! This is what happened earlier today as well. I don't love it, I'll be honest with you. Um, hmm. If the scalpel ain't swinging, you ain't ducking. No, hang on, I think it's the other way around, Sean Jay. If you're not ducking in the operating theater, you're doing something wrong. Quack, quack. Oh, cheeks, I will give it 60 more seconds and then we will restart, naturally. RJ oh, Cody! My goodness, what a blast from the past. Sorry, I've lost my accent slightly, living in America for so long. Blast from the past! There it is. Well, it's a good point, JCO. But frankly, JCO, I'm a little mad about it. If I'm being, if I'm being honest with you. <laughs> little mad. Um, no, I, I can't, I can't deal with this. This is, this is ridiculous. So, just give me a brief moment, friends. We shall remove this. I don't need you, and I definitely don't need you. That's right, I'm talking to my computer. What of it? Oh boy. Wait, who the hell is RL Cody? Off with its head! I mean, frankly, this might be the shortest... I did, Bellandora, it's true. I don't like it, though. Honestly, interns, this might just be the longest... The, the Sorry, it might be the longest hospital in the world and the shortest stream in the world. I have done very short ones on this on this channel before. Um, thank you, Sean J. Sean J. At my peak, I used to be able to remove a head, reseat a kidney, and sew up an ass in under a minute. Doesn't make sense. It's horrible. What a horrible thing to say. Oh my god. Ah, well, Sean J. Sure. I'll bring the tea. No, I won't. That's not That's not something you bring to a potluck. You know what you bring to a potluck? You bring a dish with a cover on it that's opaque. And then people reach for it and you smack their hands away and you say, You're feeling lucky! It's a potluck. And then they go, Ugh. And if they say yes, and I hope they will, you hide it behind your back. You give them a scoop. You put it on the plate. You blindfold them. And you make them eat it. Potluck! And then you shout potluck at them. Just like that. Oh, here we go. I think I think we're in good stead. 
Um, go. I totally want to play the tutorial. They, they spent... So <laughs> Cheeks, I've also missed the laughs. Unless you're being sarcastic. In which case... Frankly, I know what I'm supposed to tell you. Please uh, excuse oh. the unconventional entrance. We like to put the fun and functional here. Pam! It appears your invitations were mysteriously I missed sent you, out Pam. A early. The facility Wait, isn't what do you mean early? The public yet and hasn't been fully tested for trainees. Oh, I Never know, mind. cheeks, I, I know. I guess you'll be our beta testers. Come on through. Uh, Bill and Dora, it's not three surgeries if they're all interlinked. The head had had a massive trauma. So massive that it had punctured through to the kidney and right out the ass. Naturally, I had to reseat the kidney, reattach the head, and so have the ass. I, I, I honestly, Bellandora, you've been here long enough to- What? You locked us in? I, what, let, let me out of here, you- Oh, you son of a- All right, it's going to be like that, is it? Hmm. Wazd feet. As would feet. Wa da d da d so sword feet! Those are sword off feet! Ha <laughs> ha! Doctor Surgeon strikes again! Through the door! Uh, Alright. Well, it's. Mm, I mean, it's not much to look at, but I suppose one day it will be the greatest medical institution of the world! What do we have going on here? Hmm? Look at this. A tube of. What is that? A tube of bananas? What is that? Get, wait, what is this? Come here. Come, come here. Come here, you. What is this? All right. Just uh, maybe a can of paint. All right, team. Let's see if we remember how to do this, shall we? Oh, we definitely do not. Hup, hup. Yeah, shot put! <laughs> uh, no, cheeks. Definitely not. It's not important to bend your arm if you can bend your heart. Teething troubles oh. with the dolls, I'm afraid. What? The unlock button should be nearby. What? What? Ah, uh, Bellandora, I think it does. That's very true. <gasps> Hands off! Don't you dare tell me what to do. I'm the Dr. Surgeon MD. Hey! I can crouch through here. Now that the doctor had you, now that the hospital had you, doctor, it's going places. Caught, maybe. <laughs> oh, Shard and Jay. Woo, 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 You crazy son of a gun. Ooh. All right, so the, where this, that's how we rotate the old handaroo. That's how we get some motion out of it, you know? Okay. What is this? Do, 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 do. Bam. Beep, 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 beep. Aren't these the same? Excuse me. Perhaps I need another injection of my antihistamines. I take them orally now. No, sorry, that's wrong. I used to take them orally. Now I take them intravenously. Just put it in my veins. I tried to get them to get my tea intravenously, but I wanted it so scalding it was going to boil my blood. Literally and figuratively. Now, who left this damn coffee cup here? We don't... What, what a mess. What an absolute disaster. Oh, boy. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Don't, don't, let's not worry about it. Shrub Life. It's my favorite magazine. Excellent for punching buttons. But... But... Buttons. But, excellent. Excellent. Button work. You oh. Are natural. oh, Pam. Sweet, sweet lady. What's back here? Nothing. Locked. Hmm, fine. Alright, so it's going to be like that, is it? <gasps> Puka Jutsu, it's alright! Just as long as you're in scrubs, we can scrub together. I'll just, I'll pick you up and roll you across the floor. Put some bristles on my back, call me a broom! That was my hit single about 20 years ago. <laughs> Do you want a little taste? Put some bristles on my back, call me a broom. Alright, let's go. <laughs> That's quite enough. Sorry about the mess. Yeah, Pam. Fine. Pam. Pam is. Pam is lovely. Oh, a duck. Excellent. I could use one of these. Ah, good. My desk. Is this my desk? Sure, looks like it. Sort of a weird 1970s version of my desk. Get that out of here and get this chair. I don't. Who needs? There's no time for chairs. Damn it. Ugh. No time. 
Okay, good. Now let's get down to business to heal some surgical mistakes. All right, we've got, uh, I don't know what that says. That's, what is that, an elevator of some kind? Fine. Uh, clack, clack, clack. Uh, yeah, uh, bomb, uh, surgery is, okay, fine, we're fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Now, I can't quite remember. Um, that's how you pick things up. That's fine. This is how you turn things around. Oh, shoot. Oh, hang on. I want to get a good shot put here for all my fans. Something something only fans. I All right. Now is it shift? Yes. Look at that arm. I had an infl a stretchable arm installed to assist me with surgery. Shot put. <laughs> ah. <laughs> You're welcome. Wow. Look at that arm. He's a gorgeous man, folks. What is this? An ID card. I'm sure I left mine around there somewhere. Pam! Pam, why don't I have an ID card yet? Shot put in the bin. Yes, cheeks, no problem. There's the bin. Here comes the shot put. Can you imagine if I get it in first try? I mean, honestly. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Shot put! Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. So the inflatable limb I'm still getting a little used to. It's fine, it's fine. So don't, don't, I wouldn't worry too much about it. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, this bodes very well for the surgeries. Ah. All right, here we go. Shot, okay. Shot, what? Ah. All right, just my aim was a little off that time. Third time's the charm, third, third time's the charm. Oh, no, that was, yes. Shot put! Oh, wow! What happened there? Okay, that's fine. It's fine. You know what, Cheeks? You understand that I'm an excellent shot putter. I wouldn't worry too much about it. Now, um, something, something ID card. Oh, ah, who left that door there? Oh, good, a donut. We'll just munch on that a little bit later. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. That's not how eating works. Uh, yeah! Oh, no, someone else will slip on it. All right. You bet. Okay. Doctor, would you consider the positioning of an IV injection to be a shot put? Yeah, Pukujutsu, I would. I consider to be shot put the noblest of all sports, practiced by the Greeks in the nude, if we recall. One of the original Olympic sports, the one that, in my opinion, is probably the most dangerous to perform nude. Not because it's a danger to the athlete. That would be the javelin, or the hurdle, or the high jump. No, because it's a danger to the spectators. They used to mill about the amphitheater, you know. You'd get an extra ten points if you clacked your mother on the head. <laughs> what? Anyway, Pukujutsu, the point is... Pukujutsu, don't you have a thing today? Oh, God, did I miss it already? Oh, my God, I'll have to watch it later. Ah, oh, shoot. Pukujutsu, did, did you have a stream with a wonderful couple of cosplayers today? A podcast recording, my apologies. Okay, let's see. Lots of ID cards. Wait a minute. You have three ID cards. Four ID cards, Pam. Five ID cards. Hey, Pukujutsu, I'm so happy for you. Everyone, uh, Pook, can you, can you point out how... Can you direct people to this podcast business? I tried to start a podcast once. And they told me my molds weren't good enough. Badoom chair. That's uh, ca casting a mold of something. <clears throat> All right, let's here. Let's let's just take the let's just take the idea and be gone now. <laughs> anyway, I'm Dr. Pamela Preston, one of the founders. Well, I'm keeping You're your ID back, Pamela. To trial our surgeon simulated training program. Wow, thank Exciting. you, Pam. It's very kind, Pamela. I appreciate that. It's because you know I'm the best of the best. That's what you. Wow. Look at this place! It's a freaking madhouse! Just the way I like it. Alright, oh good, walkers, brooms, paints, strange surgical bottles. Yeah, they're just very thick ID cards. It was a stream, but they're going to be editing it. Oh good, good, good. Pukujusu, presumably it's to edit down all their fangirling squeals. Nothing but filler. <laughs> filler? I hardly know Phil. Alright, here, oh, oh jeez, that was... 
Hang on, I have to practice my shot put. This this arm has been very uh, distressing to me as of as of uh, so far. Good. Shot put. Very good, Doctor. Very good. All right, we'll keep we'll keep Pamela's ID card just in case it requires. See, there's a few different doors I can go through. What's this? Ah. Temporary brick storage. Oh, you so so stupid. <laughs> why would you why would you have brick storage for bricks? Doesn't make any sense. Just make a wall out of the Oh, I see. That's what they did. All right. Well, I'll leave your idea card here for now, Pamela. Can I have my locker, please? Good. Excellent. Empty. The way I like it. That's that's very good. Yeah, let's move this roll of carpet. Ah, good. You know, I have to say, I've become quite adept and agile already. Ah, good. Doctor, one of the people in the audience fainted from fangirl squealing. I had to employ tactics that I learned from your lectures. Good, Pukujutsu. The old WST, did you? Water in the face. Slap. Talk. Sorry, don't don't actually slap someone in the face if they're unconscious. It doesn't make it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Just don't do that. Buju, so I'd love to know what you were, uh, what what you had to, what kind of techniques you employed. Also, if you're on this if you're on this stream right now and you haven't heard of Disconcordia, my social media manager is signaling me wildly. He's doing one of these. <laughs> Stupid. What an ass. You are. Oh, God. Um, oh, well, I mean, between friends, Pukujutsu, what's a little slap and tickle? Right, sorry, what I was saying, before, right, yeah, right, of course. My social media manager and Pukujutsu are reminding me, if you don't know anything about Disconcordia, head over to our Discord channel. You can find some information there about Disconcordia. A 24-7 live role-playing server of Changeling the Dreaming 20th Anniversary Edition. Pukujutsu, good shit. Pardon my French. Excellent. Exactly. There was an injury. Oh, quick, jump into surgical medical mode. Oh my goodness. I have to do no harm. Ah, but wait. We have to do some harm in order to do no harm. Slap and tickle. Not the euphemistic one, cheeky C. All right, Pamela, we're taking your ID badge a little further. Get these boxes out of here. What the hell is this? It's telling me to, what is this, jump? Jump! I said it's a work in progress. Yeah, well, that's one way of putting it, Pamela. I call you Pamela. What? Ah! <clears throat> Where do we go? Oh, shoot, they do need the badge. Badge, badge me. What? What? What's oh, the new one? Cheeky see you see. <gasps> I'm always losing those things. I'm not even what? Damn it, Cheeky see. It's not a complete sentence. Alright, good. <gasps> this is Bob, a Barnardshire local. Bob! Very well indeed through the Bob! The I missed you. Let me kiss you with my slubby lips. Ah. Patience, real conditions, simulated scenarios. Mm. Interesting. Able to tackle all kinds of medical oh, gosh, I missed you. Oh, terribly exciting. Where have you been all my life, you big we lug? Training with a quick heart transplant. A quick heart transplant. Don't Perfect. Worry, I'll walk you through it. It'll be a breeze. Good. Oh, but. I'm not sure why that door's locked. Uh oh. Julian, why is that door locked? Yeah, Julian. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we'll have to come back later. Let's try something a little different. Onwards. What? Oh, no! Yay! That's right. It's me, the Dr. Surgeon MD, with Rosie the Riveter hair ties and a very long arm. Don't worry, this is just the face I'm employing today. Woo! Woo! Wee! Cheeky C2, the cleaner. Okay. Let's try this instead. Mm -hmm. 
We're going to attempt a leg transplant. Okay. Seems pretty straightforward. <laughs> what do you take me for, an amateur? Ooh, ooh, it's getting a little jerky, isn't it? Hey, team. Please let me know if it's really terrible. I'll see what I can actually make and see what I can do about it now. Just give me a brief moment. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. Oof. Turn that off. Let's see, turn that off. Turn that down. Okay, that's a bit smoother, isn't it? Hiya! Yeah. That gadget with the screen is a diagnostic scanner. It'll tell you what's wrong. Oh, with Bellandora. Patient. Probably a one. test. And I'm Keep going to pass. Eye on Bob's blood level. If he bleeds out, it's game over. All right. That's fine. Ah, look at this fancy. It's According all digital. Scanner, Bob's got a dodgy right leg. Rip it off. Now, my right or his? My right or his? Okay, his. Bob is sick. Oh, boo hoo hoo hoo. All right. Rip his right leg off and put it in the chute. Put it in the chute. I am so excited. Look at this. Bob, you beautiful bastard. Good. Ah, now perfect. Pop the leg in the chute. Hup. Bye. Right. Great. Now use a yellow syringe to stop Bob's bleeding. Got it. No problem. Ah. How do we do? Whoa, it's still going down, still going down, still going down. Oh, jeez, perhaps Stop we have to inject it. With a yellow we have to inject it at the site of the... <sighs> Blood loss rate. Ah, now, right in the penis, I understand. On. Just a moment here. Excellent, good. Rock pants, I understand. Study hard interns, that's very important, very important. Elispot asks an excellent question. What kind of hospital is this? The answer, Elispot, is an efficient one. All right? It's an efficient one. Good. All right, well, here's the new leg. Um, it looks all right. Hmm, I'm not sure how we're going to quite get that bone ready, but we'll figure it out. Drugs! Bellandora, I too have missed drugs. Get Lovely work. Whoa! Remember, Bob! When you rip off an appendage, Bob will bleed out very quickly. Let's continue. I mean, it makes sense to me. It's generally how blood loss works. How do I do? The top bone's connected to the bottom bone, and then in the middle you have the kneecap. Uh, ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time to cut. Just rip his leg right off. <laughs> um, yep, yeah, straight through. Anything else we need? Of course there is. Ugh. What's, what is a surgery without a celebratory drink? The drink, of course, is orange shot pot! <laughs> uh, I'm entertaining myself, that's the important thing. Give him a top up with a red syringe first. We have top up blood now! Oh my god! This is the greatest day of my life! Bob, hold still, you crazy red bastard. Here we go, oh, oh. He's looking better already. Rather than just ripping off a limb, use a little more finesse this time. Finesse. Why don't you grab a saw? Oh, I remember that saw very saw well, cheeky. Saw see. Uh, where is your grip, drop it and garbage? Try again. Align the saw with the cutting line. Place it down gently and saw back and forth until the limb drops off. That's all right, Bob. You're gonna be fine, bud. Remember. You're gonna be fine. If you use the saw, Bob will bleed out much more slowly. Good. Yep. Arms at your side, Bob. No, 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 Bob, 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 Bob. Arms at your side. Arms at your side. Good. No. Bit. Saw his right arm off ah. and pop a fresh one on. Ugh. Let's have a quick look at this fancy ass diagnostic machine. Um. All right. Let's get a saw here. What do we have? I think I saw one in here. <sighs> Put it along the dotted line and cut. All right. It seems. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. He's making so little air angel. Yeah. Pop a fresh one on. Don't, Pam, you can't rush perfection. Uh, 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 oh God, this is worse than that time I had to clean up all that viscera. Oh God, it's terrible. 
Bob, what the hell are you using for skin? Titanium? Oh my good lord. <laughs> yeah. Ah. Uh. Oh my, oh jeez, oh sorry, sorry about the neck, bud. You know, chicks dig sorry, scars. Am I swear to God. <laughs> Yay, hurrah, oh jeez, oh sorry, Bob. Oh, 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 we're losing blood quickly. That's all right, I'm a professional. Take the yellow stuff. No, not the piss, bring the yellow stuff. Jam it in his leg, or something. Excellent work. Oh, oh boy. Saw his right <sighs> off and pop a fresh one on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pop a fresh one on down. Oh. Oh, they have little ice boxes. Wow, you have everything here at Barnachard. Real ice? <laughs> Real limbs? Me? <laughs> All right. All right, Bob, hold still, bud. Yep, hold still. Yep, just Bob. Bob, just hold. Stop. Bob, Bob. Bob, I'm warning you. This is for your own good. It's for your, you for your really own god. Now remember, Thank for a you. successful appendage transplant, Bob must have all of his limbs and head attached. Uh, dis proceed. agree to disagree. Pam, uh, agree to disagree. Sometimes one must do some harm in order to do no harm, as we know. And sometimes, in order to reattach a leg, you got to take off a head. You know, it's, it's... That's why I'm ahead of the game. Terrible. All right, get, excuse me. All right, fine. Okay, a little rude. And Lock me back. And organ Excellent. Remember to check the diagnostic scanner. What do we got here? No Bob to found. A successful transplant, the sick organs must come out. Yes. The rest of the organs are optional. Crack the ribs with something heavy to get Crack the lungs. the ribs. Grab a scalpel and stick it into a lung to remove it. You can just rip organs out, but Bob will bleed out much more. Quickly. Right, 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 right. Bellandora. I'm glad to hear it, you know. I hope to be an inspiration for doctor, surgeons, and doctor surgeons everywhere. We little doctor surgeons with their tiny little white coats. So cute. A little, a little gentleman ran up to me the other day and he said, Mister, am I going to one day be a great big surgeon like you? And I said, no, shut up. You have to study for hours. Pam, I'm trying to do a thing here. Damn it, Pam. There was a good joke in there. Now you've ruined it. Fine. All right, let's crack some ribs. Good, all right. Red, yellow, shot put. Yep, DJ, exactly. Oh, good, we've, okay, that's just meat. Crack the ribs. Yes, yes, Remove yes. the old lungs and pop in some new ones. All right. How are you doing, Bob? Pretty good, huh? Click, clock, click, clock, click, clock. That is, that must be incredibly horrible for you. I'm so sorry, team. Good. That crunching sound means you're in. It's very important. Not you're in, but that you are in. It's very important. Just, just give the patient a little pound. Like a, you know, like a, like a steak of some kind, you know? Why is decapitation even an option? Cheeky C, have you ever seen certain people? They need head transplants. Oh, just do my hair and my teeth. Oh, and don't, if you don't mind doing my eyebrows at the same time, how about this eye? If it, the whole head comes right off. Boom, you get a perfect new one. Oh shoot, now I'm not supposed to just rip them out, apparently. That's a pretty neat little scalpel. All right, Cutitha. Oh. Give a little pound also Crack means you're in. Oh my Remove god. Oh! Thanatoast it! I'm glad you're here. Can you describe what's wrong with your arm to me whilst I perform this very intricate operation? Oh! Oh no! Oh! Oh god! Alright, that's fine. No! Oh! 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 Whoa! That's very bad. Very, very bad. It's alright. No, no, we're just doing It's an anatomy lecture. Alright, it's. Uh, we're, we're doing anatomy. The chest bone's connected to the bladder bone, I think. Uh, and this lung should just pop right out. Very good. Look at that. And that's how you know it's a healthy lung. No, wait. That's how you know it's an unhealthy lung. Unhealthy Cut lungs. The ribs, remove the old lungs and pop in some new ones. Here we go. New lungs. Hup. I just drop that in there. I'm sure they'll figure it out afterwards. 
Interns can probably handle the rest. This is the uh, challenging part, though. Hup. Excellent! Remember, Easy! Easy! When my friends and I built this place, Keep calm we and do drugs about the Wait. mysteries of surgery to the world. <gasps> Me too. Anyone, no matter their background, can become a surgeon. Hey, wait a second, Pam, I said that. All it takes is a can do attitude. Pam, are you did you steal my idea for Barnetshire General? Look how sassy I am. God, I love it. Wait a second, did Pam just Did Pam steal my idea? Whoa. Whoa! Oh, um, then a toaster. I don't think I'd worry too much about it. Have you considered going into uh, the realms of surgery, the art? On, um, sure what else would benefit from that sort of thing? Uh, have you considered going into? Ah, oh, yeah. Have you considered becoming a uh, a real walking, talking, reachy, grabby thing? Instead of using a grabber, they could just use you. So what's the problem? You can now access all uh, areas with game modifiers that dramatically change the environment and levels that are designed to be mixed and matched for novel experiences. I love a good novel experience. Especially when it's crime and punishment. I love a good novel annex. Something, something changeling. Alright. Here we go. I, oh, God. Ah. Oh, wow. Don't I look great? Don't I look great? Just kidding. It's me! Oh, God. Just kidding. It's me! Alright. I'm gonna read these out. Just look in a mirror. And just look in a mirror. I have to ask, team. Do I look more like a Kamal or a Milo? Milo is affable, but a bit of a drifter and a daydreamer. He's a fan of crustless spam sandwiches. Oh! Get out of here. I'm clearly Kamal. Stylish and reserved. Classic. With a sponge-like brain for knowledge, it just sucks it right up and wrings it out onto the paper. He likes tea with lots of milk, baked vada, veda, and talking to plants, and expresses himself through his spiffy dress sense and on-point moustache sculpting. He hopes to absorb the latest cutting-edge medical knowledge and maybe spruce up a few surgical scrubs. No problem. Splendid. This is my f this is my face for the day. Let's see. Ugh, plague mask, fish bowl, or dinosaur head. Well, we're gonna go with the plague mask, obviously. Nah, it's a bit silly, frankly. Um, I guess we'll go with the fish bowl for now. Oh, shoot, where's the default? Uh-oh. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I prefer any of these, frankly. Yeah, there we go. That's, that's nice. Yeah, that's very nice. Good. Always use your gloves when performing surgery. Now, I know I didn't used to be a proponent of that. Oh, ducky. Um, so I'll just put you right here. Oh, shoot. Oh, gosh. Um, oh, oh, go oh, jeez. Oh, okay. Right. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, clean up on, <laughs> clean up on aisle five. Uh, um, Right. I know I didn't used to say that gloves were necessary, and frankly, I don't think they are. However, I have found them invaluable when people get angry at you, getting a little antsy, you know? They're like, oh, oh goodness, why on earth would you be touching me with your dirty hands? I say, excuse me, madam, these hands are cleaner than any part of your body's ever been. Didn't take very kindly to that, you see. Uh, Cheeks, I tend to agree. Is it too much? <sighs> I just look so damn dapper and dashing. In other words, beginning with D. Read into that what you will. All right. Oh, good. Ah, my jello cake. Excellent. All right. Oh, wow. Now that, that is how you know it's a good jello cake. Hold the plate upside down. Doesn't wobble at all. Excellent. Now, of course, the test of a good dessert. How does it shot put? Fantastic. My god. That's great. Alright, here we go. See those big glass vat tubes on the other side of the room? We can use those to get anywhere in the entire facility. Oh, lovely. But before we do that, we'll have to use the terminal to set their destination. Very important to set your destination before going. 
Right? Very, very, very important. Um, unravel the mystery behind the Bossa Labs medical facility. Alone or with friends? Well, I am alone for now. But, perhaps not forever. Daring, debonair. <laughs> Dashing. <laughs> Other words beginning with D. Come on, someone's got it. Docile, very good. Um, delicious. D uh, d d don't open the door to him. <laughs> that one was a little rough. All right, to the story mode. Heartbroken. Well, that doesn't sound nice. Bob's heart is on its way out, so we need to open him up and plop in a new one. Hammers at the ready. Heal the patient. In under 10 minutes, losing less than 700 milliliters of blood. Well, in under 10 minutes seems like it should be pretty straightforward. Why is this not scrolling down? Dauber. As in Jeffrey Dahmer. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, okay, well, it seems unlikely, but we'll try it, right? Let's, let's give it a shot. Wonderful. Now, before you head off, we highly recommend bringing some friends along. Oh, you'd Lord like me to bring along friends. Too bad! I'm the greatest surgeon of all time! Now, which one do I take here? Ooh, alright. Should all be the same, I'm assuming. I'm ready! Let's try it. Oh, goodness gracious. I will say, the vac tubes to get surgeons to different parts of the hospital, now that, that is a, that is a breakthrough in technology that I can get behind. You know, I also love a good warm push of air on my bottom. Poor Bob's heart is on its way out. Oh. Luckily, our bioreplicator unit, the brew, uh -huh. has produced a replacement. Oh, good, good, good. The brew is our greatest achievement and works almost perfectly. It seems a little graphically challenged again. Oh shoot! Uh, oh god, can I not? Can I not pause? Oh, oh, jeez. Um, off, off. Ah, uh, ah! Uh. It's fine. It's fine, Doctor. It's fine. All right. Well, we know how hearts work. Let's just get in there. Bob. No, it's chocolate. I don't want chocolate. Bob. Bob, are you in here? Damn it! They didn't even. They didn't even put me in the room with the patient. What's wrong with this place? Oh, I see how it is. We need a key card. Uh, no wonder the ten minutes. Ten minutes seems. Yeah, I see now. It seems like it's going to be difficult. It seems like it's going to be straightforward, rather. And then, you learn what you have to do. And it becomes all the more... Can, can I help you? Yeet. Here we go, here we go, here we go. What have we got? Nothing, we're just in the backwoods of this hospital. Oh, good. Ah, mmm, hospital food. Delicious. All right, whoa! Flashlight. What's in here? Is that the heart? Open, 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 ses open, see same, open, see same. All right, well, we'll just take it. We'll shoot, take it with us anyway. Oh, jeez, Louise. All right, it's fine. It's fine. Call me Doctor Felony, Scalp Serum Purveyor. <laughs> Is this where I came in? What do you mean, not protected? Seems like a terrible waste. Ah, interesting. All right, well, this is not so good. We can't even get to Bob without that ID card. Ah, ID cards! Just must have walked right by them, you dummy. What a dummy! A beep. Just leave that right there for now. Excellent. Bob awaits you. Check the diagnostic scanner to see what's ailing uh, him. Well, we know. It's his heart. Good. Now, I'm going to need a hammer and probably some fine pointed object. Come. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, goodness. Okay, good. All the scalpel... All the scal... All the scalpel... All the scalpels are... Ugh. Fine. You know, who left these boxes here? Ugh. Ugh. Good. Good. All right, here we go. Oh! Oh, you're locking me in, you bastards. Why are you in the vents? Bellandora, why are you not in the vents? Bellandora, I had to find... Look, I wanted to explore the the hospital a bit, all right? And then you understand I had to... 
you had I had to find the key card to get into C Bob. It's just a trap of some this is horrible. Really, really sorry about this. It's probably very horrible to watch. Where is the blood notice? He's fine. Damn it. Bob, your ribs! What are they made of, mate? Oh. There must be a better way to do this. It's not quite so dizzying. Dizzying hides and dizzying lows. Surgery's going forward. Nobody knows. Okay, 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 okay Bob! Your chest cavity needs to be caved in, you animal! You animal! <laughs> uh. Oh my god. Bob, this is, this is absolutely f f f Oh, that's much better. Good. Aha! Aha! Good! Alright, now. Let's put that right there for safekeeping. How are we doing? Good, he hasn't lost a drop of blood. Really makes sense, but it's all right. Scalpel. I need. Uh, I need. Uh, um. Pokendora. <laughs> I named that one after you, Bellendora. I hope that's all right. Good. How about this one? Good. And of course, now the real challenging part, of course, will be where are we going to get a new heart? And is he still bleeding out? Oh, yes, he is. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. We just need some. Shoot. Need the badge. Whew. Badge me! I said, I said badge me! Alright, well, we need to make sure that. Ah, I see. They're going to need more than one. Now, that's fine. That's fine. Your security protocols are bad, and you should feel bad! Maybe I'll need the other one as well. I sure wish I could use my right hand. Oh, come now. What? Good. Uh, I have Bellendora. Didn't find it too effective for the heart transplant, Ooh, but... Someone's messed with the fridge door. What do you mean? What? What do you mean? Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Oh, wait! I can just put the heart in there. Shoot, now where did I throw it? Excellent. Uh, green. You can tell that's not good. <laughs> All right, so far so good. Get, go, go, do something. Oh, shoot. Um. Oh, I need a different key card. Well, 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 well. Come on. I sure wish there were yellow and yellow drugs around here somewhere. Okay. Oh, my old office. I rather miss it. Me too, oh. Pamela. Hey. Hey. Look, don't believe anything she says. You don't know what she's capable of. What? <gasps> I've got to go. What? Who is that? What? Who was that? Oh my god. Perfect! Good, I found the I found Pamela's badge. What the hell? Who was that? Did you everyone all the interns, you all heard that, right? Too soon to plan ahead. There was someone in There was someone in in the vents. Julian! You know arms and legs don't belong in there. I'm sure it is, but secret projects on your own time, please. Ugh. Ah! Uh, um. Aha! Good, good. Here we go. Now, if I had had access to better drugs, I would have been able to save the patient much sooner. I left everything just lying around. A very fine thoracic surgery, and he still has all his limbs. Excellent. Thank you, Pamela. I'm not going to tell sorry Pamela. The hiccups with the doors and such. These rooms were designed to test your surgical abilities, but I guess we've still a few kinks to iron out. Hmm. Julian, I've got a job for you. Interesting. Now I wonder, interns, 
Hey, I got an A. That's nice. That's nice. I wonder, <clears throat> interns, what they're implying. Who was that strange man in the vent? Why was he trying to warn me of something? Well, he healed the patient. It's the most important thing. I do like a good mystery, though. So I suppose we're gonna find out if that's uh, anything useful. Yay! Oh, I got a bear! What is that? A little something for my finger? Pull my finger! Rah! It's a, it's a bear. <laughs> I don't know. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Says this one should be tip top. Let's just see about that. Build a better bob in under five minutes, losing oh, less than 400 milliliters. Ooh. As always, I have to disable a few things here. It seems very jerky when we first start out. Apologies, uh, interns. Oof. That does not look very nice. Oh, do you think it just needs to take? It needs to take a bit of time to. Yeah, it just needs to take a bit of time. All right, what do we got? Get me in to see Bob! Stat! It's been a long time since I've said stat. All right, what do we got? Whoa, his blood is very low, and we need to replace his arms. No problem. Where is your red junk? Ah, thank you. Right, just jab him right in the hand. Oh, sorry. Uh, sorry, I said hand, but I meant th the stomach. Good. All right. Well, that's probably enough, right? Ooh, okay. Ah, build a bear. Build a better bob. Very good. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. All right. Good, 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 good. We are looking for some sort of saw. Oh, something to saw his arms off with. Hmm. I'll put another red in him just while we're here. Because I'd rather not rip the limbs off. Well, if I had a yellow standing by, perhaps that would work. Good, yeah, just keep going. Come on. Give give Bob some more blood. Damn it, he needs it. This man is low on blood. What have you been doing to him? Ah, what is this? What is that? Is that an organ? All right. Ooh, ugh, ugh. No, thank you, DJ Zesty. Do you have anything sharp I could use? <laughs> Excuse me. Let's check my locker. No, empty. Empty. Damn it. Hmm. All right. Well, that's probably fine. I could just rip them off. Ah! Can I? Can I get? Excuse me. Can I get under here? I just need to get in there now, please. Now. Oh, I see the problem. A button do. Ah! Some medicine balls. I'm sorry, I really don't know why these doors are locked. Yeah, well, I don't like your attitude either, Pam. I'm starting to get very confused. Whoa! Legs? What am I use legs for? Interesting. Right, 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 that's correct, uh, DJ. I mean, you know, do some harm to do no harm and all that. It could be a whole host of things. Whoa! Eyeballs! Wait, do we have to do we have to build a whole new bob? What's happening here? Damn it. It's very creepy. Uh, okay, just a washroom with some eyeballs. Perhaps they're watching us. Plunger. Oh, probably not good for sawing. It's interesting. It's become sort of a puzzle labyrinth. Left arms and right arms are depleted. If I could get in there, it would appear to me... 
It appeared to me there are arms in there. How do I get in? This is the question. Maybe I can go through the vents. Perhaps I need to go through the vents. <sighs> Darn, why can't I fit through here? Curse my long proportioned body. Hmm. I realize we're just sort of shilly shallying. But I have to do something. Ah! <gasps> oh! I could throw something! Aha! Aha! Alright, give me one of these legs. Desperate times, desperate measures, interns. Alright, here we go. Never has a shot put been more important! Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh, no, no, what am I doing? Leave that leg. Leave that leg, surgeon. Here we go. Shot put! Oh, jeez, they're heavy. Woof. Tell me they're not going to fit. Uh, uh, yes! Yes! That's what you love to see! Oh, you beautiful bastard. That was wonderful. All right. Uh, good, 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 good. We have all sorts of things ready. Do I have to place one in order to get one? Hmm. Still looking for swords. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here I go. Here I go. Here I go again. No, wait. And we have to be very careful. I don't want the patient losing too much blood. Come on, that must be working. That must be working. Bob, your titanium skin. Oh, I think I got him in the head. How's he doing? Whoa, not good, not good, not good. Come on, don't worry, Bob. I'm here. Oh, no, his head came right off. Oh, no. Well, of course we're trying again. I know exactly how to fix this situation. This view would be more immersive. It was a surgeon elephant with a trunk. <sighs> BJ, how are you? What's going on? Julian says this one should be tip top. Yeah. Let's just see about that. Oh, don't go off in a huff again. It's once again, it's very, very difficult. Maybe it just needs a moment to load. Sorry if it does, team. All right, well, I know what I have to do now. I'm gonna give him some blood, first things first. But I know what I have to do now. Good. Good! Bob, you brilliant bastard. This is, this is wonderful. I have to say, this new bondage in general has a lot to improve it over the old one. Strange puzzles, but, you know, I love a good challenge, so I'm not too mad at it. Do 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 do. Third. You know what? Give him a third for good measure. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Ah. Oh. If for whatever reason, DJ, you've already responded, I can't see it. And if you have not, that's fine. No, you'll have to... Oh, shoot, I think it's my chat log. Graspy loot! How the heck are ya? What's going on? Oh, right. Graspy loot, watch this. They've set a task that appear... You know, they, they think they can stop me with their little physics puzzles. But they can't. I'm the Dr. Surgeon I'm sorry, MD. I really don't know why these doors are locked. Thank you. Cleanliness is the key. Hiya! Very good, Doctor! All right. Now, we have to be very careful, because last time I sawed his head right off. And that was, uh... 
No, decidedly not so good. Ah! Whoa! Okay, fine. Whoa! Whoa, Bob. <laughs> I love making my own little soundtrack. Good, good, good. How the heck are we gonna do this? It's challenging, isn't it? In turns. Ugh. Graspy loot, how the heck are you? It's been a while. Feels like it's been ages. I mean, it's been ages for me, but perhaps even for you and this channel. Oh, whoa, whoa. Um, yeah, that'll be fine. Boo -doop, boo -doop, boo -doop. Saw his arm off! Yeah! Good. Does that music mean that he's running out of blood? Sure, hope not. Good, 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 good. Yeah, they did, didn't they, DJ? Very interesting. I think I have to bring... I think I have to bring those with me. Oh, isn't it horrible how quickly the limbs just die without the host? It really feels terrible. All right, here we go. Yeah, so lucky that there were so many medicine balls just lying around. I love balls. Excuse me. Excuse me. Just put it in the... Come on, man. Put it in the damn tray. Put it in the tray! Ah, fine. Oh, oh. Oh, I care about left and right. Ugh. Whoa, whoa. Here we go. Here we go! Yeah, well, Bill and Dora, you know, man's got to have... Man's got to eat. Shoot, which one was this? This was the left arm. Yeah, that seems good enough. Oh, not at all. Graspy loot, that's wonderful. The Premier League, I assume, of football. Well done. Yay! The progress of our surgical revolution. It is a bit ridiculous, isn't it, Graspy loot? Ah! You, you wish you could trick me. Ooh, got chilly all of a sudden. All right, I got an A. That's pretty good. Good time, aren't we? Meow, 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 meow. Good. Well, team, quite pleased with how this has been going, to be completely honest with you. Quite pleased. I'm very impressed at how you've taken to the unique nature of our facility. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, yes, yeah, so we just have to let this... Oh, this horrible jerkiness needs to just start... Uh, needs to, um... Maybe if we enable V-Sync? No, that's that's actively worse. All right, that's fine. It's just going to take a while. All right. What am I... Wait, what, what did I have to do? Heal the patient? Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, good. Yellow, hammer, scalpel... Um, oh gosh, what is it? Is that a skeletal arm? You can't just leave skeletons lying around, Pamela. I guess you'll need an arm to get through here. <sighs> no problem. Didn't say what kind of arm, did it? <laughs> the ladies' team beat Luxembourg 10 nil. Now that's incredible. Oh, oh come on, Pamela. This is an arm. Because it doesn't have flesh or muscle. Fine. Bill and Dora! Tell me about your cat. Is your cat... Uh, how, how cute is your cat? Sorry, in turns, I'm just going a little crazy. Don't, I wouldn't worry too much about it. Oh, this place is a mess. This is so embarrassing. Julian? What happened in here? Anyway... 
So, okay, we've got right legs, left arms, and large intestines. <laughs> Ready! Pass through there. Some sort of horrible freezer. Ah, good! We'll need an arm to get through here. Good, good, good. Um, no, we'll wait on that. Boop, 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 boop. This all, whoa, wrong way, wrong way. Through to surgery, come along. Oh my goodness, it feels, oh, Bill and Donna, that is so sweet. There's a cat in this home. My oh, social media manager's oldest cat is almost 15. And that is very old for a cat, I felt. 17 is so sweet. No, I know, DJ, it's quite impressive. I've played a few games of football in my time. They made me quit because I wasn't... Oh! oh! I was too good. <laughs> That's what I was about to say. What do we got? Show me the bob! Like Bob's been wrestling combine harvesters again. <laughs> <laughs> good one. Uh, okay. Arm, leg, intestine. Good, no problem. Well, I know where I have to go for these. And we just need the old ones. Great, this should be fine. Wait, which arm, which leg? <laughs> that was a close one. Is that working? Is that, is that working for you, Bob? You like that? <laughs> sorry, sorry, team. It's not what I, I don't mean it like that. All right. Oh, the yellow! I should go back and get the yellow before before it's too late, Bob. Oh shoot, that's his neck. Whoa! Should have gone to do that right away. Sorry, Bob. Uh oh, oh god. Um, oh jeez. All right, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Where is the yellow drug? Good. Still losing blood quite rapidly, and I don't like that. Okay, good, good, good. We got that. Yes, Bellandora, please pet your cat for all of us. Oh, hello, John. How are you? What's been going on, John? Uh, we're just trying to solve the mystery of this new Barnardshire General whilst still performing surgeries. Damn it. Oh, God. Oh, Bob. I... Oh, jeez. That's probably very bad. Yeah, that's not so good. All right. Well, interns, it's all about being cool under pressure. You know, so sometimes when you have to be cool under pressure, you just need to jam a man in the thigh or leg uh, or elsewhere. <clears throat> okay. Now, Bobathan. Bobberton. Ah, oh, that was working. That was working. Come on, come on. You son of a. Oh, jeez. Ah, ah, ah. I bet John knows all about this action. Ah. Ah, the sawing action. Yay, Bellandora, please. I don't want to be weird about it, Bellandora, but please. Please do. Uh-oh. Organs everywhere. Organs everywhere. We're going to have a bleed out very shortly. Bob, just hold on. Just hold on a bit longer, Bob. Bob, if you could keep your blood inside your body, I'd be ever so grateful. Yeah. Duh. Duh. This is terrible. Oh, jeez. That leg is almost off, Bob! You bastard! <sighs> oh, jeez. Oh, this is... Okay. You know what? I bet we're in trouble. Here we go. Yes, I hear your dingling dangling. I hear it. Oh, come on! It's fine. I don't consider these sorts of things failures. I 
consider them learning opportunities. As should you, interns. The lesson I was trying to convey there is to always stay cool under pressure. You see, the problem is I got a little frazzled. And a patient died. I took my saw to his leg and I ended up removing half of his internal organs. It's not good. Bob! No! Yeah, I agree with Bellandora. Bob's skin is very strong. Sort of a titanium alloy of some kind. I don't... I don't like it. Exactly. Ellie Spot, good. I, I, I'm surprised it took... Yeah. You're saying it like it's a surprise. The patient has to... Look, I believe very much in patient responsibility. As in the patient is responsible for their own uh, assistance. You know, for assisting themselves. Alright, well, we're gonna do this again. Here we go. Here we go. Here I go. Here I go. Here I go again. Uh. Uh, sorry about the... Oof. Sorry about this team. Did that work? Of course not. It's the wrong kind of arm. Oh, I don't have the right kind of arm. He shall live a happy and full life. Exactly, Elisbot. Exactly. Ah, uh, sorry, DJ, rather. I guess you'll need an arm to get through here. Yeah, I guess I will. Ah, my dear brother's old office. Brother? Brother? That's mysterious. Who is your brother? Why did they leave a fully mustarded hot dog? The plot thickens. Ugh. As does Bob's arteries. Ugh. Ah, oh, my... A wise doctor once told me if the cure doesn't hurt, the patient just goes Looks out and like gets Bob themselves hurt again. Combine harvesters again. You know, do some harm in order to do no harm. It's, it's essentially correct. Wait a second. What's... What's the matter? Why is this not... Aha! Alright, good. Well, we have we have a stopper now. Perfect. Okay. Ooh, and... There seems to be next to this... Bedpan! Ugh. Sorry, Bob. Oh, jeez. Sorry, Bob. No, I'll just clear, clear this clutter for you, I suppose. What's through there? Oh, just, um... Some ventilation. Keep the Bob station clear. Very important to keep the Bob station clear. All right. Um. Good. So saw time. Saw me. Saw me with them hands. Saw me. Saw me with them hands. <laughs> no. Wait. Not the neck. Not the neck. Very careful, doctor. Don't, don't show me orange like it's not working. You know it's working. Ah, ah, oh God. I dare you to put the hot dog in the body cavity. DJ, dare accept it. Because what is medicine without a few little jokes? Ah, oh, good. Oh boy, okay, all right. Uh, uh, so code yellow, not the good kind. I hope everyone appreciated that joke. Took a lot out of me. Ha ha ha, something something. You're in. Alright. That's good. <laughs> no. No! Bob must survive! Got it? Good. Okay, well, it could have gone. Could have gone a bit better. Um. Alright, you know what? I'll go get the hot dog now that I have a moment. Don't worry, DJ. This hot dog will come to pass through Bob's body. <laughs> you know, it's important when you wake up from surgery, you're often hungry. It's because you haven't eaten in 24 hours. Bob here is probably going to have been at least 48. He's going to need someone to provide him with a little sustenance. Oh, Bob, don't play with your food. Mustard deficiency. Perfect. I'll put it in the cavity when there's a bit more time. Uh, now, where did I leave that sawing implement? <laughs> ah, yes, the saw. There it is. 
Oh, actually. Just also yeet these things whilst I have a moment. Three, two, one! Ugh. Probably good enough, Doc. I don't like the fact that he's got so much blood lost already. I don't love it. Okay. Ah. Bit of yellow. But surgery can be a delicate operation, pun very much intended. <sighs> Come along, Bob. I hope that blood spurting isn't actually blood that he needs. It doesn't sound good, does it? It sure doesn't. Don't worry, Bob. Don't worry, Bob. We're coming We're coming back for you momentarily, Bob. No, this doesn't sound good. Yeah, it really doesn't sound good. More yellow! Stat! Oh, shit. Alright, there we go. Did it? <sighs> Stabilize the patient. I wish we had more blood in here. That would be very, very convenient. Like right there. Like right there, Doctor! Always look around, you dummy! Good! Uh, ah, sure. We have time. Let me blood him up a little more. Woo! Interns, this is exciting. It's been going quite well today. I feel like I should have a story or time or something. You know what kind of surgery I don't do? Genital enlargement or reduction. You know, shake what your mama gave you and all that. T to be honest, actually, if someone ever approached me and said, Dr. Surgeon, you're the most famous of all surgeons. Can you can you help me because my back hurts all the time from various things, uh, like the size of my penis? Uh, you know, I would say, of course, of course I can help you. Of course I can. Uh, just, you know, <laughs> just whip it out, I suppose. <laughs> Horrible. All right, okay, it's fine. So close. Ah! Bob, you bleed at the first sign of anything. Oh, he struck me with a saw for two seconds. Ugh. Hmm. Wish I had a better surgical implement than this saw. It's not very effective. So close, Bob! Just get that leg right off! Ha-ha! Now, we just follow that up with a little bit of hallucinogenic drug. Stops the bleeding. Good. Good. Excellent work, Bob. Okay. The old leg, of course, goes in the chute. <laughs> well, I will be using it momentarily! Okay, good. Can I just straight remove this intestine? That would be very, very useful. Be -do 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 -do. <sighs> Ugh. DJ, that is horrible, but, you know, understandable, I suppose. Ah! 
Uh, Bellandora, I'm very happy with that. Thank you so much for the update. Please make sure that uh, evidence of the photographic nature has been posted. If you are comfortable, of course, we would all be very happy with that. Bob, take your medicine. Good! Oh yes, and of course, sorry, DJ, I hadn't actually done this yet. Uh, it seems Bob doesn't want to eat. He's going to have to eat intravenously. Do 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 do. Oh, this place is a mess. This is so embarrassing. Oh, Julia, I'm sorry to report that this area is not set up as intended. Hmm. I'm afraid you'll need to improvise. Improvise is my middle name. Doctor Improvise Surgeon MD. <laughs> this is an arm, isn't it? Very good, Doctor. You know your anatomy, don't you? Alright, good. Now, of course, we just throw these back through the little cubby. Uh. Oh, I'm sorry. Are these chairs and tables in your way? Yes, they freaking are. Of course they are. Look at this. Ridiculous. What the heck's kind of state-of-the-art million-dollar facility is this? Wait, a million dollars for a hospital? That's nothing! Peanuts! I've had peanuts that cost more than that! <laughs> Here we go. Here we go, Bob! Should we put an arm on his leg? This is the question. Good. Excellent, Bob. Wow. Very malleable limbs, and I'm ecstatic for you. What? Why is he bleeding? He's bleeding out. Why is he bleeding out? It doesn't make any sense. Stabilized. Just one more organ left. Right next to the hot dog. Good. Did we did we make it? Oh, his other leg came off. Well, that's terrible. Jeez, the weasel. Nice that happened. Oh, yeah. Um, if you finish with Bob, could I just Bob? Not on this channel, Doctor Nima. Oh, whoops, sorry. Sorry about that. Let's continue. Who's Doctor Nima? Well, this is very interesting. The plot thickens. Does it not, in turns? Meow, 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 meow. Whoo! Okay, well, a pass anyway. I could try again, but we'll we'll return to this when we need to. Oh goodness! All right, okay. Interesting combination of sort of various puzzles and surgery. I like that. Good for my good for my mind muscles. Stretch my mind. Yay, I got a new hat! Oh, I do love a good hat. Where's Team Fortress 2 when you need it? Am I right? Ladies? Question mark? Doesn't make any sense. Alright, let's <laughs> continue. Please forgive the Kung Fu Fenris! That was Dr. Nima Chandra. Who's, who is Nima Chandra? Nima has some trials of her own going on somewhere in labs. Uh -huh. She's making real progress. I bet she is. Why on earth is the diagnostic scanner? Oh, Julian. Pam! Kung Fu Fenris, how are you? We are in the midst of, well, surgery, of course. This is the new, it doesn't get less bizarre. Good. That's what I like, graspy loot. It's important to not get less bizarre over time. Is that going to get Bob in here? Oh, but without the diagnostic scanner, how am I to know what he needs? Very interesting. Very interesting. Notice board. Aha! We can put a little power in the... We can juice up the... Juice up the power. What kind of considerations, Kung Fu Fenris? What, ki what kind? Are you considering something about Disconcordia? Please let me know. Whilst I uh, take this sponge, make myself a loaf of bread with it. Ugh. Okay, no, nothing there. But in here. Ha! Ah! Ah! Uh, aha! Okay, that's where that lives. And that will be for that door. I see. 
I need some sort of generator. Yeah, gen generating power thing. Look, I'm a doctor, not an engin en 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 engineer. Are you alright, Dr. Surgeon? No! I'm not alright. Bob needs my help! Now, we have to go find some power. Phenomenal cosmic power! Whew! Kung Fu Fenris, it's been good so far, I have to say. We've been uh, doing some surgeries here. Um, all's relatively well. It's a bit odd. Barnisher General, very much under construction these days in a way that I don't appreciate. But we live and we learn. Do we not? Where am I going to get more power? Very interesting. Aha! Uh. Have we been bamboozled? I cannot confirm nor deny the status of my bamboozling. Graspy loot. But I can tell you this. I am a doctor. There's a vent up there. Ah! I got your ice tray! Alright, where the heck... I need some sort of power. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Alright, well, if the interns have any idea, th this is hardly my area of expertise. I should be operating on this man! Sorry, sorry, Bob. I meant to pat your face, but I pat your junk instead. That's not what I... Oh, boy. Inimineng engineer. <laughs> that does sound like something I'd say, DJ. Seriously, I need some sort of power. I mean, I don't need it, I suppose, as of yet. There might be other ways around this mess. <gasps> a duck! Oh, give me that, give me that duck! Oh, uh, doctor of philosophy. Oh, Kung Fu Fenris, good to hear about Disconcordia being positive for you. I love to hear that. Less positive about the communication issue. Less positive. Um, I'm hoping that and this is going to sound a bit strange, but I'm hoping the communication issue can be solved by da -na 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 -da -da communication. I hope that's possible. Is there... Ah, can I remove power from another place? Probably not. No, definitely not. <gasps> oh, thank you, Bellandora! I'm so happy that you were able to join us. Be well! And, uh, you know... Keep calm, drink tea, do some harm to do no harm, etc, etc. I, <laughs> I hope that makes you very happy indeed. Oh, shoot, I should have gone here in the first place. Look at this. Ugh. Ah! Please pretend you're not seeing this. What? Oh, look. Oh, my God. Oh, jeez, what is this? Ugh, what a disaster. Well, you know, Pam, I wouldn't have to see it if, you, if your damn facility was in operation. Is that, is that open? Julian has freshly stocked the storeroom for you. Aha! Good, good, good. Okay, that's good then. That's very good. <gasps> and a diagnostic machine. Give me that. Yes. Ah, a diagnostic scanner. That'll be nicely. Sheldon J, tell me about... What is your position on ducks? Do you... Do you enjoy them? Oh, shoot. Oh, jeez. That's probably worth about a million dollars. Oh, jeez. All right. We'll, we'll be, I think we're going to be fine. Oh, okay. Diagnostic machine will save us. Beep boop. There is nothing. There is no god. Only a diagnostic machine. Yay! All right. Bob needs blood. Holy crapola. Bob needs a heart <laughs> and a stomach. Do they have any grapes? That's a good question, Shan J. Uh, Graspy Loot, I, uh, my social media manager is one of the storytellers for Disconcordia, if you are asking me that question. Um, so, you know, I suppose, yes, but just not very often as of now, but hoping that that will change in the future. See what's in here. Something we agreed on has changed, and I only discovered the change when we were in the middle of it. Oof. 
Oh, I see. I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Well, that's, that's, I see, that, that is challenging. Kung Fu Fenris, I don't often offer relationship advice. Hope you bought a jumper. Um, you know, for obvious reasons, but what is this? Ah, a piece of bread. But I am hoping. Oh, there we go. Uh, now he wanted. Oh, shoot. I think it was. It was a heart and some lungs, I think. Look at all these. Look at all these hearts. Ah, get. Get over here, this slippery bastard. Whee! I can't remember now. Microwave the power source. Look, uh, I will say Kung Fu Fenris. Uh, what is that? A stomach? Good. A stomach and a right leg. Okay. Uh, neatly organize your workstation if you have time, which we definitely don't, but we'll try our best. There we go. I'll just sit that back very nicely there. Perfect. All right, okay, hang on. There's too much happening in the chat now. I just want to say to Kung Fu Fenris, I am hoping that this is able to be resolved through a discussion between adults, you know? Oh, something's changed, but I didn't realize. I'm so sorry. I hope that we can work it out now that now that it has changed. Is that a stomach? It doesn't really look like one. Bob has the tiniest little stomach I think I've ever seen. Wow, this, is that a kidney? Ugh. I think, that, I think it's a stomach. My god, Bob, if that's your stomach. Ugh. Hup. And... Shard and Jay is talking about candy organ straw, spleens on toast. I wouldn't mind one, Shard and Jay. Um, it does seem a little distressing, but, you know, we'll do our best. I think that's the, the correct leg. Oh. Got stuck. Oh, we've got we've got a stuck we've got a sticker. We've got a stuck situation. Yeah. Oh god. Oh, wrong way. Wrong. There we go. Good. Now. Now we simply, very simply. Oh shit. Oh. Ah, I see. Well, Kung Fu Fenris, if I can be of any value in that endeavor, I have a, apparently I have a very soothing voice. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. What a shocker. <laughs> Good one. Have I grown in size? DJ, <laughs> please. I'm married to my work. Good. And... I'll take all these bloods back out there. May as well, right? Get Bob all blooded up. Yeah. Good. Yeah, I am with John on this one. Sleep is awesome when it works. You can't always understand that. Perhaps you should try counting sheep. It's something I've been known to do. There goes Bessie and Dolly. And that little one's Trisha. The mean looking one is Trisha. <laughs> ah, I'm just kidding around, I'm sorry. I mean, it's it's kind of a problem, isn't it? I am designed for comedy. And not so much for the drama. And by drama, of course, I mean sincere emotional conversation. But, we do our best. Shot put! <laughs> oh, right. Oh, shoot. Um. I still think that's a stomach. Oh, come along. Fine, fine. The leg will stay on the floor. Eh. Eh. Oh, God. I feel like a crab. Not like I have crabs, mind you. Just like a crab. If you all... Do you all understand what I'm... What I'm getting at? <laughs> all right. One more bit of blood for Bob. I can see how this would be more useful with multiple surgeons. Perhaps I should get some interns in here sometime. Feels like it would be quite straightforward, actually. One person does all the surgical maneuvering, that'd be me, and the other person runs around and finds everything. Yeah, just get it in his junk. Seems like a good place for it. Come on. Come on. There you go. Uh, 
Ah, Kung Fu Fenris. It happens to the best of us. It's something to take steps towards, for sure. Uh, take steps, you know, towards trying to resolve is what I'm what I'm getting at here. Now, take a little yellow drug with us. Oh my god, here we go. Here, come on. Come along! <laughs> Damn it! You beautiful Mary Jane, you... Ah, uh, uh, got it. Good. This is a very important yellow drug for Bob. All right, we leave it in a very important place. There. <laughs> All right, now... Stomach, uh, whatever leg that is, and the heart. All right, well, let's smash open a rib cage, shall we? And then I think we'll call it a night. It's been a good day so far. Lots of surgeries, lots of mysteries. You know how I feel about surgical mysteries. I like them. <laughs> ah, more things. <clears throat> more batteries, or... Whatever these are, power cores. Yeah, I'll put one in there at the same time. Uh, uh, just, oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> there we go. Now, where are my surgical implements? You bastards. You bastards! Give me back my implements! Oh good, here they are. So again, if I had an intern, they'd be able to run and get me these things. I would say scalpel, and they'd run and get me a scalpel. In this case, I say scalpel, and I bring back a hammer. Stupid intern. Me, I'm the intern in this situation. Uh, 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 uh. Crack the rib cage gently, like you might fillet a duck, or crack the rib cage of a small bird, perhaps a um, some sort of French bird, a little one, it might be eaten by a French president or something. Just crack that gently. Crack that. Get on the floor. Crack that. And give me some more. Crack that. Uh, good. Very good. Bob, this is pretty chill so far. Not so bad. Not so bad. Just clear those right out there. Okay, good. Seafood in your pants. I don't... Rashad and Jay, I, I, first of all, I don't see food in my pants. And second of all, you should know, I'm allergic to shellfish. People. I'm allergic to shellfish people. <sighs> you graduated, damn it! Use Latin! Or at least the best language. English. British English. Oh, shoot. I don't just. Oh, jeez. Diagnostic scanner, I swear to God. Ah, very good. Okay. Scalpel, and we will remove the small organs first. I think that seem I think that's going to make sense. Catch the doctors next. I have I am a doctor, Sheldon J. I suppose I'll have to catch myself. Look at all these implements. Gorgeous wooden handles too. I mean truly spared no expense. Wouldn't be surprised if I saw a Velociraptor coming through here next. Hey, ho, hey, ho, hey, ho, hey, ho, hey, I can't stop. Somebody help me. Hey, ho. <laughs> All right. So, we do a poke poke here, we do a poke poke there, we throw the organs on the floor, and we stick it all about. You pull the organs out of Bob, and you shake him all about. That's what it's all about. Uh. Um, you pull the right lung out, you... You shake it on the floor, then you go for the left lung, and you shake it too. <laughs> you do a little shaky. <laughs> oh, you pull out a kidney by mistake, and you shake it about. <laughs> That's what it's all about. Oh no, the yellow! We need the drug! You know, I've been told that my love is one's drug. But that's not quite right either, is it? Good. Good work, Doctor. This is going very well. I will say these time limits you're setting me seem very inappropriate considering I also have to deal with this mess of a facility. You know what, just remove all the organs. I, I like a blank canvas. I'm like Picasso. I'm like the Picasso of surgery. 
put things back in in strange orders and unusual ways. Healed. Very good, Bob. Very good. Look at Bob. Look at this smart-looking little gentleman. All right. Well, the heart goes back in. That should be all right. Yeah. Good. And is this a stomach? I suppose we're going to find out. Ah. It's getting hot in here. So, uh, fitty down. Uh, 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 fitty down, fitty down. Fitty milliliters of blood, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, next is the leg. Good. Uh, our old friend, Sawtooth Jones. It's an old friend of mine, Sawtooth Jones. Truly one of the worst, uh, sets of mouths and teeth on the British Isles. And, as you probably know, that is definitely saying something. Uh, okay. Sorry, DJ, I'm sure there's more. I can't quite see it at the moment, which is a problem. Silly chat. It's like my social media manager is not even working right now. It's like he's not even here. It's like he's away. It's like, he, it's like he's playing another character. Does that make any sense? Are we bleeding? We are bleeding. Is it too bad? It's not too bad. Cut. Cut. Come on. Saw those genitals. I said saw those genitals. <laughs> oh, shh. It's all right, Bob. You're going to be fine. I swear to God, Bob, if you bleed out now, I'm going to be furious. Oh, shoot. Uh-oh. Good. Get this stuff out of my way. Ah, now now I see the end of your joke, DJ. Very good. Very good. <laughs> yes, I know. I know he's bleeding out. I know. I just need to remove this leg. Uh, get out of here. Yeah. All right. Quick. Pop it back on. I said quick. Damn it. Yay! I'm sorry about the missing scanner and the fuses. Oh, the fuses. Dr. Hmm. Joshua, I know you're creeping around in those vents. I don't know why you're intent on ruining everything, but you must Dr. understand Joshua. you're only endangering Robert. Who's Dr. Joshua? Who is that? Ah! Ugh, creepy. Still like these pneumatic tubes. It's very good. All right, well, it was not ten minutes because I was all those fuses it's very confusing confusing not great all right well I'd, i still say well done got a traffic pylon excellent show people that there's going to be you know caution ahead oh goodness gracious it was then that the doctor realized that he was operating in the wrong hospital he was no joshua he was no Joshua! Uh, what do I have? That's quite dapper. What do I have here? A glove, a different glove. What? What is that? A little bear. Mm, fedora? Ugh. Bowler hat? Yes! Now show me your little hand, bud. Hey! What? Hand! Bear! Put the, take the glove off and put the bear on. Oh, he's so cute. It's great for little children. Oh, hello. I'm Bob the Bear. Today we're going to be removing your appendix. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you stupid son of a gun. Hey, I think that went pretty well, frankly. Yes, I do. Yes, I do want to quit to desktop. Interns! How charming was that? It actually worked! I don't believe it! We just had to start it off, reload it, and then play it again, and every single time we had to do something about the graphical quality. But that's alright. It's alright, interns. We're not doing this. We're not doing this for fun, for entertainment. We're doing this because it's science and art. The best possible things. Now, I better catch a bunch of you over in the Disconcordia server. I can't wait for my social media manager to be able to jump in and play with y'all. 
A little wait later. Did, did you really need me to say y'all? Ugh, God, I hate him so much. We all do. When we have a convention, you know, it's me and Sergey and Paul Prospero, Emperor Scottimius sometimes when he deigns to come along there, Justin McCready, uh, Adam Jensen, you know, we all get together. It's very strange, frankly, a whole bunch of different dialects, very different looking people wearing different costumes, you know, it's, it's a very different kind of situation. Um, and yet, we all agree, that social media manager, not entertaining, not fun to watch. He does streams on Saturday nights. <laughs> Doomed. More like your acting career. Why am I doing this? <laughs> Interns, I am so incredibly grateful to have heard you all here today. I um, don't have much more to say than that. It's very fun. It's a very good time. <gasps> don't, don't you dare tell me that it was unavailable. Oh, goodness. Whew. I thought I hadn't gotten my achievements. That would be a disaster. I think I'm going to call it right here, interns. I I, uh, I quite enjoyed that. I'll leave you with a bit of light music, as you might uh, as you might you know enjoy yourselves for a few moments. Um. Oh, actually, hang on. I suppose I'll find it before I do anything else. Oh, there it is. Perfect. What can I say about the rest of this week? Uh, I believe John Vero will be playing. Oh uh, shoot. Le Rune Terra is a card game of some kind, I believe, tomorrow over on his channel. Uh, Thursday, I believe there's probably clinic hours. Uh, Friday, Punchy. Saturday, it's Drew Crew. Strap in for the Moonstone Mystery. Do I really have to say that? Ridiculous. Uh, Saturday evening, perhaps something doomed related? Question mark. We'll have to see. Um, and then beyond that, Sunday is Exalt Witch Academy Season 2. Episode 11. Holy crap. Ellie Spot think of Legends of Runeterra. That's what I said. I said Runeterra. <laughs> Damn it, John. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. Uh, Ellie Spot, thank you. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. I appreciate everyone who comes out to join me. We do these things for entertainment value. Because I know life can be difficult, and sometimes we just want to spend time at our computers laughing our tuchuses off. And then having them sewn back on. Or, using this wonderful diagnostic machine, shoved back on with some super glue. Hope to crack a few limbs back on with you next time, interns. I'll leave you with some music. ta, -ta for now, or as they say in the British Isles, get the hell out of here and take your mug with you. Yeah, scamp.